it turns out different parts of the human body can live for a while and even fully resuscitate after a person is clinically dead. All this means Teen Wolf's many cases of death avoidance isn't the plot armor a lot of people seem to think. For example, many individual cells, like the ones around Kate's neck wound, can live for weeks after brain and heart function has stopped. Healing cuts like this is largely a chemical process and doesn't require an active brain or new oxygenated blood to start as long as the cells are still viable. And if you happen to have a supernatural spark of energy that also provides a healing ability, One of the most famous cases of death avoidance from the show is Scott's season five Tangle with Liam, followed by this death blow from Theo. But his, his heart, he, he hasn't had a pulse in over 15 minutes. You, you can't bring someone bag that's he's not someone he's my son and he's an alpha it turns out mason's declaration of a 15 minute time limit is kind of wrong i mean yes a human brain being starved of oxygen for that long would be a mess but the human body has been known to restart on its own even several hours after what doctors call dead one famous case of this so-called Lazarus syndrome involved a woman in West Virginia who was brain dead for 17 hours. They kept her alive with machines all that time. They turned off the machines. She woke up and recovered. Again, if you add a little werewolf Come healing on. to that. Come on, Scott! Now, some of this could be applied to Peter, too. I mean, he needed the increased spark activity of a full moon, plus the power of an alpha spark to get him going. But that was like two or three weeks after he was buried. So the natural processes needed that extra kick. Of course, all this creates the opposite question. Why did blank die? <laughs> You can fill in that blank with anyone who stayed dead on the show. Some were obvious. But most of the time, Teen Wolf doesn't bother to explain why a character can't just heal from whatever happened to it. Aiden! 